Engineer 775 here. I'm here with Johnny Valentine from Gain Solar, and we are having fun on this beautiful day building our prepper power cart. What are we doing here? Well, we're taking a 48 volt golf cart. It's got six 8 volt Trojans, brand new battery bank. And we are going to add to this a Magnum inverter charger, as you can see. And this, though it's covered up, is its debut. Is this true, Johnny? What? Nobody has seen this. Oh, that, the power pack? Nobody yeah. has seen this. So we're here debuting this beautiful right, piece of equipment. Maybe you might be able to find one YouTube video. Okay. One other YouTube video. But here's Magnum's new charge controller. Their MPPT charge controller. It's called a power track. So what we're going to be doing is adding... For our demonstration, we're actually going to a prepper camp and we're going to be the power providers for the camp. So we thought at the campground where there's golf carts everywhere, it'd be appropriate to take a golf cart, convert it, add a power plant to it using the batteries from the cart. We're going to be using these big Anderson connectors to the battery, connecting it to, oh, where's the other half? Yes, connecting it to the Magnum inverter so that we will be able to supply the power to run these big tents and um, audio equipment for a three-day event. Uh, we're going to use 1800 watts of solar that we're gonna hook into the power track. And we're just, a lot of this is mobile and we're still trying to figure it out how we wanna do it. Um, make sure you watch the commercial at the end of this video and, and check out uh, Gain Solar for all your solar needs. So what else can we tell them, Johnny, about this? That's about it. We'll come back and give you an update once we're fit, finished. If, you, if you've already got a golf cart and it's 48 volt, we can do this. It's very easy. If you've already got a battery bank. You might not even be thinking about it, but that's yeah. Wouldn't not it be a huge battery bank? But it's enough of a battery bank to have a uh, portable power plant. Portable power plant. So if you needed to go someplace into the woods with your saw, maybe. You could go and cut wood. You could supply power to a cabin. Um, you know, if you have a bug out cabin, you have a golf cart, and you're like, how can I get power? Well, bring the power to it using the golf cart. So we'll be back with a finished product. Okay, we got everything wired and it's looking awesome. So we've got two, uh, two boxes here so we can run our tents and AV equipment. Everything's wired up. We also added a generator charging uh, cable here that we could hook to our little Honda generators and the only thing we have left to do is hook the solar in and we'll do that up at prepper camp so we are powered and everything works great ran a few grinders and things so here we go all right just showing you another view of prepper camp we got tents one two the big tent three and four I believe tonight William Fortune will be here speaking he's got his new book out one year after so we're just uh, Classes are breaking up now. There's a uh, rotation of classes all day long from 8 to 5. And uh, there's our power system we built just temporarily for the camp. The 48 volt golf cart, magnum inverter, about 1800 watts of solar. We're just running all the amps and lights and audio visual equipment for the camp. So that's been a lot of fun. And then over you can see oversee the prepper mall. Everybody's uh, selling their wares, and I think that's ours over there in the corner. Yes, yes. Ah, somebody's, somebody's over there stealing my products. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> anyway. I don't know where it goes, but same thing with this. It disappears. So again, it's $9 at Walmart. Well, it's early Sunday morning at Prepper Camp 2015 been a great event we've been blessed with awesome weather and uh, we've had fun just showing off the power cart the uh, systems work great flawless just turned it on uh, we've only with the 1800 watts of solar has been more than enough I don't think the batteries have ever gone below 49 volts so 48 volt battery bank so they it's been great so uh, Johnny and I have just been talking about all sorts of ways to be prepped getting power to folks so so far so good this has been great 
And of course, you can, we can actually get you a system like this, configured for a cart, if this is something that's appealing to you. Or we can take this system as we've mounted it to a board and put it in your house. And uh, so we are kind of had fun with the golf cart just because there's golf carts everywhere on this campground. So we just thought we'd try to fit in. And uh, hopefully we're going to build a, a charging station for this campground that'll have a, a fixed array. And the carts can pull up and plug in. There'll be integrated charge controllers and combiners for the array. So they can just plug in to their uh, battery bank, charge up. And also in the central, kind of the meeting house, we're going to put this system uh, to run their well pumps. There's a laundromat, uh, vending machines. There's just a central location. That could be a great place for people just to go and Maybe just charge their cell phones. There's a lot of people that show up here from time to time, but we feel that this Magnum is the perfect fit uh, in a complete off-grid, uh, grid-down situation. So we'd wire it differently, of course, but this is, we have had, I don't think we've pulled more than five amps for the whole, at a time for the whole weekend. So everybody's waking up now. It's a, been a great, just a, it's a great spot, beautiful spot. Uh, Kids and people have been playing in the playing in the pond, swimming and boating and paddling around, and starting to smell some breakfast. People are cooking and uh, getting woke up here. Um, I'm going to actually be teaching the Sunday morning sun, sunrise service here in the tent. Uh, we had Dr. Fortune here last night uh, talking about everything and um, just. Uh, I think uh, people really enjoyed that. It was overflow, and a lot more people showed up. Uh, the overflow of this tent, this was absolutely full. So it's been really good. So I hope they continue this tradition. It's the second year of doing prepper camp, and uh, just been an, an awesome time. So anyway, let's, uh, let's continue, and I'll show you some more about prepper camp later on. All right, folks, we're back out here on another Gain Solar install. And as you can see, we're just getting it as hard as we can. We're buying our PV wire on 2,500-foot spools, folks. We don't mess around with 500 no more. We just can't get this solar up fast enough. Here we go. We got us a 1,400-watt uh, solar array. It's got six panels on it. It's just cranking down the power. Once again, soaking up that good North Carolina sunshine. Come on in the mech room, folks. We're going to show you what I got. Got us another Magnum 4024 inverter. This one's a 24 volt, folks. Don't let me throw you a curveball. She's making just as much power as she needs to. 4,000 watts of pure 12240 pure grid power. She's coming in right at 60 hertz in the sine wave. It's smooth and cresting. It's got the peak. It's got the trough. It's got everything you look for in that waveform. Here's my battery bank, folks. Shrunk her down a little bit in size, but she still got the amps when you need them. 395 amp hour. She's a gain solar special, baby, and she's wired hot. She's ready to go. We got them torqued down. We got them goose greased. We got them protected. We got our automatic watering kit in here. As always, vented to the outside. Got a little something different here with the PV power plant. We got our Midnight Classic. She's pushing down the power right now. She's got 900 watts of charging, and this person's in state of charge connect. But up here, we got something a little bit special. Got us a little Midnight solar controller. This is a Midnight kit brand new controller and she's running on a little micro hydro turbine and you better believe that wheels in the creek and she's spinning she's spinning just as fast as she can a wheel within a wheel it's a wheel within a wheel and she's just a spinning and spinning and spinning and spinning and spinning game solar baby remember you heard it right here we did it for tesla come on down for our september special game solar